<laughs> that was the best part of the whole movie is where Jacob has his little vision of eating Edward's face off. <laughs> that was great. Um, so the the whole Isle Esme thing right now is really funny because he just keeps running away from her. She's all like, look at my cute little nineties. He's like, nope. And she's like, let's be jump in the rivers. And he's like, I'm not gonna have sex with you, but I'll jump off a really rocky cliff with you. That's cool. And then he just like swims away, and she's like, I'm gonna get ya. Oh my gosh, I don't know why I laughed so hard, but seriously, I was in a fit right there. And she just keeps prancing around in her underwear and playing chess in these booty shorts or whatever. And he's like not having any of that. And she has to beg her husband on her <laughs> I forgot how bad this book was. Oh my goodness. So she has to beg her husband on her honeymoon to sleep with her. That's, that's hilarious. It's only, only in Bella's life. It's great. It's a great day. Is she eating chicken with peanut butter? It's disgusting. Ew, now she's throwing up. Ew, I'm sick. You can't do this to me in the movie when I'm sick. Um, ew, god. Peanut butter and chicken? No, that's not cool. Edward's like, <laughs> Edward's like when your computer freezes and, you know, like, you, you keep trying to make it do stuff, but it just goes ding, ding, ding. It just doesn't do anything. That's what he's like right now. It's so great. Yeah, it's like as soon as Alice calls, he's like, oh god, it's true. I was so excited for this. I am so excited for her to give birth. You don't even know. So let's see her spine break and blood. It better be awesome and be so mad. Rosalie, I need your help. Activate your baby production powers. Um... Seriously though, it's been an hour and an absolutely jack has happened in this movie. Oh my god, stop calling me. Seriously, if it's 60 minutes in and nothing has happened, they ran around an island. Okay, they got married, they ran around an island. Wine, wine, why won't you do me? Oh god, I broke the bed. Oh, bruises. Oh, I'm so sad. Oh, let's play chess. Oh, okay, fine, I'll sleep with you. Oh my god, I'm pregnant. Okay, now we're an hour in the movie. That's all that's literally, literally happened in this movie is terrible, but terrible so far. I don't even know, it's bad. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> they did such a good job of making her look, like, bad. She seriously looks like a gremlin. <laughs> oh my gosh, I like palms on her face. Her forehead is so big. <laughs> oh my, she looks like Schmeagol. Schmeagol, Schmeagol, whatever his name was, Gollum. Like, seriously, her face. I can't even get over it. Oh, my goodness. She looks like a skeleton. I can't stop staring at her face. <laughs> they did such a good job making her look awful. Because, oh, my goodness. Like, she looks like a skeleton. Seriously. I don't know. Did she lose weight? What is, uh, what is this movie magic? And can I get some, please? I would like to look a little bit thinner. I don't want to look like a skeleton. But, oh, it's like... Dude, she looks straight up scary. Ugh, okay, I'm done talking about it, seriously. Am I supposed to understand what the crab is happening at this wolf powwow? Because I don't hear, I can't hear anything, but and then they're like talking about something. I mean, I figure they're talking about freaking baby thing. But all I can hear is Sam, and then I heard Bella, but she's human. Our protection applies, and then Leah butts in, and then rah, 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 and like I can't hear any of it. <laughs> so I'm really, really confused right now. So I'm just gonna watch them fight, and hopefully I'll hear something. I guess. But Seth is so cute. He's just, even as a wolf. He's like, Ooh, sad thing. Seth gets all the awards. All the awards. He's so cute. Let him win. If it's the right thing to do. Rock on, Seth. You tell them, and you, you actually, I wish they had killed the baby, but you know what I'm saying. Good for you. Okay, so <laughs> I totally read this website that Edward just Googled. Oh, excuse me, he didn't Google it, he Yahooed it because now we're all, all about Yahoo. But anyway, I totally read it as immortal. Come. 
because that's what it says. There's like an eye, but it's kind of hidden. So I was really just like, Edward, really? Of all the things you could Google for this, that's what you're going to Google? I'm, oh, excuse me, Yahoo. Um, actually, kind of makes sense. <laughs> Immortal. <laughs> okay, no, I'm done. I'm bored. <laughs> so this is like the worst movie review ever because this movie is just boring. Um, nothing happens, just like in the book. Uh, it's just a lot of talking and, uh, and angsting, and it's not even good angst, it's stupid angst. And I'm bored right now. I just want her to give birth so she can die. Like, that's all I've been waiting for this whole time. Where did he get a sippy cup? Like, Carlisle's like into a glass, and Edward's like, hold on. And goes and comes back, and he's got a sippy cup, like a plastic, a styrofoam cup with a straw. What? What? That's <laughs> like retarded. That was so stupid. <laughs> oh my gosh. The scene where he like can hear the baby's thoughts really. <laughs> Two seconds ago he's like kill the baby and then what? what? He loves you Bella. He loves me. He's so pure and good and I can tell this just cause he's thinking about how much he likes his mommy. Okay, even though if you could really hear his thoughts, shouldn't, like, he hear it in a female baby type voice? Or the babies all sound the same, I guess, kind of. I don't know. But I thought that was really cheesy. So. <laughs> when she tells him the name, it's so funny because it's like, I was thinking of running with our mom's names. Renee and Esme. I was thinking, dramatic pause. Renesme. <laughs> she says all this like a completely blank face the whole time. Well, it's funny because they're like right after each other. Renesme. Renesme. Like she made some epic discovery. It's like. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny. She looks so bad. Oh, the scene. <laughs> I'm like excited because I, like, this is what I've been waiting for all day. I'm like, ew. My god, her face. I can't even handle how ugly it is. Like, ugh, this is so nasty. That was the worst birthing scene ever. And all I can think about is how Robert said that it tasted like they used strawberry jam and cream cheese for the crap so we could eat it. <laughs> can't even. Ugh. I could seriously make me gag right now. Oh, and her face. I just cannot get over her face. Oh my gosh, she looks so bad. Okay, if this were real life, Bella would be dead. They have been trying for like five minutes to bring her back. Like, first off, they took forever to do it. They're like, I don't know. And then my baby is so beautiful. Oh, blood. And then like, she's dead. They're like, oh, here, hold your baby. No, flip and change her, get it over with. And she's like dying on the table, and the baby bites her, and she's all like, mm, whatever. And then she just like, <sighs> and they're like, oh, the baby. And then, and why didn't Jacob imprint then? Because he definitely looked at the baby like five times. But whatever. So I'm a bit confused by that whole deal. So now they're like, Trying to make it dramatic. Go <laughs> live, Bella. You have to live. How could you not come with my giant syringe of venom? <laughs> that had to go through her heart. Like, it missed because it was so long. Anyway, it was just. Uh, this whole scene. She would be dead if this is real life. But this is not real life. This is Twilight. Nothing makes any sense in Twilight. <laughs> The creepiest baby face. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Jacob just walked in and imprinted on her. And I have to admit, I really like whoever they got to play older than this man. She's really gorgeous and pretty, and I really like her. But that baby is creepy. It's huge eyes that are like, I know what you're thinking. It's like a one of those like dolls that comes alive at night and eats you. So, not really a fan of that, but older Renesta Tart is like, 
she's got beautiful hair and bare eyes and she's really pretty and I really like her. But um let's see. I'm gonna go kill that baby and then he sees her and it's like blurry lens and pretty music and there's an over voiceover thing going on. Oh beautiful Twilight, beautiful. So funny. But but like I'm surprised how much I like whoever the crap is older than Esme. <laughs> Thank you. It's over. Yes. I want the hour and a half of my life back. Nothing happened in that movie. Nothing happened. If this were not, excuse me, I'm being rude. If this were not like made off of a book that actually, you know what? Nothing. It, it, it's just pointless. Like, the book and the movie. It was just pointless. Also, I like how becoming a vampire automatically gives you awesome makeup. Like, oh, my eyeshadow. Does it change to match whatever you're wearing? Or is it always going to be that brown color she's got right now? And her lips are automatically... And, oh. Uh, uh, her eyelashes. I'm going to be a vampire? No, but seriously, though... And that whole spine cracking. Like, I, I wish I could rant about this movie. Like, super rant. But I really just don't. Like, it was boring. And I'm, I, don't, I don't care. And I just don't even know. Her face doesn't change at all. Like, all this crap is happening to her. And, like, she's still just, like, Kristen Stewart face. I don't even know how that, how? You just had a baby, like, I mean, you have a baby, and it's killing you, and now you're dead, and, like, the whole time, she's just, like, Chris to her face. Anyway, so then, oh, the stupid spine, and we get, like, an inside view of all her veins changing, whatever. And her spine goes, pfft, and, like, pops her back up. It's so gross. Uh, anyway. Um, yeah, I, I really don't know what else to say about this movie other than I was thoroughly bored. It literally took me all day to watch it. Like, it's dark now. I started watching it at, like, 11. No, I had a different point at 11. I started watching it at, like, noon. It's 5 o'clock. Because I just... Uh, wasn't interested. Like, I would watch bits of it, and I'm just like, oh, I go to something else. <sighs> but still, yeah, yeah. But it's over now, and you have my reactions. I, I'm way more excited for part two because we get other vampires. This part was like all the crap nobody cared about. <laughs> that stupid baby, whatever nightmares of it, just like, oh, oh, Jacob, there you are. I'm like, why does he, like, have a future visions of her being older? I'm assuming, like, at the age that he can make out with her. I don't know what's going on there. Um, it was creepy. But, anyway. So, out of that entire movie, I liked Charlie. And... Oh, older Renez Tars. That's it. Uh... Yeah, like I can't even make fun of Kristen and Rob's acting anymore because he does that enough for everybody. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I'm sorry that this video was not as awesome as I totally thought it was going to be. But I just, well, I just wasn't into it. I just wasn't into it.